Welcome back to Critterland. Well, today I have this Calico Critter Sylvanian Family's Vintage Kitchen, which is pretty cool. Uh, I got this from Kobe Japan. You might remember from the bakery haul video, and I promised to do a little video on it. So here we go. Now, this is pretty well known. Uh, this is not, like I said, an uncommon set, um, but it's been out of distribution for quite a while. Uh, probably about uh, 10 years or so, maybe five years. Uh, and it was quite a while ago that it was actually uh, produced and released. So uh, you may or may not uh, have seen it up close. But here it is. Uh, this is from Kobe Japan on eBay. And uh, these are all the little pieces. They always take good care of uh, packaging and wrapping it up. All right, let's take a look inside. And there's my magical power at work. Uh, so yeah, um, this is just a really gorgeous uh, kitchen. I love the little sink detail. Of course, they've got the piping underneath as was common with the older kitchens. And some little tile detail with these stickers that I'm not too fond of the stickers. I, I'll probably take those off. Um, but the uh, I love that sink. And this one matches. It's got the little tile detail and some little hooks probably for pot holders. The drawers open and there's plenty of room below. It's got a little cherry detail on the sticker. So it is cute, but I'm just not really a sticker fan, personally. Whoopsies, we're missing a drawer. There it is. And here is the oven. Uh, this oven is pretty common. This comes by itself and other says, whoa, what's in here? We've got some baked goods. Oh, that's fun. So let's get these little rolls or sweets back on the tray. There we go. Very cute. And this tray came out of the oven as well. So this doesn't close quite right. Uh, it's a little stuck there. It's a little weird. And there's also a little uh, mark, if you saw that on the side. So I'll have to buff that out. And these are a bunch of leftover stickers, so I really appreciate that they didn't plaster it with stickers. So that's really great that there are plenty of uh, ones that are not on. So here are the chairs. This is what I love about this kitchen, are the green um, seats on the chairs. And the lovely lighter color, kind of a cream color. So here's a look at all the little accessories. We've got this little pot. It does say flower on it. <laughs> Um, and then uh, a carrot, which it's kind of like, almost like feels like an eraser. It's got kind of a rubbery texture. Sorry, that's not focusing very well. Um, so it's kind of, you know, squishy. And same with this, uh, looks like a gourd or a pumpkin of some sort, squash. Just has a really soft kind of rubbery texture. And we've got quite a few little baskets to put it in. These are really pretty little baskets and they fit underneath nicely. And we've got uh, this beautiful little tea set. I think the same tea set comes in the uh, Hillcrest home, just in white, but with different saucers and all in white. And there's that beautiful teapot. It's nice and big, and my big fat fingers are having trouble opening it. There's a look inside, and the beautiful little cups. These are shiny. Now, one thing I noticed with this set is they gave me two different plates. This one here on the right is shiny, and the one on the left is more of a mat, and it has the little like uh, edges where they would twist it out of the plastic. But that's okay. And we will put these little uh, seashell-shaped rolls on the oven and this beautiful little pot. I love all the colors. I mean, it's painted on the handle and on the pot. Um, very cool. And then these are little cans of tea. And I love that they say tea on them. So we'll put those there on the shelf. There's an orange one. And then we have, I think this is a sugar dish. And that's also got that rubbery kind of feel, like the uh, vegetables. And this can be a cooking pot for sure, but it does say flour. And it will not fit right there because of those hooks, but it does fit nicely there. We've got a little uh, basket tray with nothing to put in it. I'll just stick that there. And then we've got this beautiful cutting board, which I will put here. Whoopsies. Stuff's fallen. 
And we've got a little knife and a spatula to complete our little kitchen accessories. Very nice. And a tiny little salt and pepper shaker. Put those up there by the oven, or by the, the uh, sink, <laughs> not the oven. And there is a basket. I love the green color. So very nice. And our kitchen is all set up. I love it so much. I'm not sure which house we're going to put it in. We'll have to think that through, but now we've got some variety. I wonder if a drawer is meant to go in there. We'll put the basket in there for now. And I love that part of the sink. It really looks realistic, like the part where you dry the dishes, maybe. Very lovely. Well, we'll get some bunnies in here and let them test out our kitchen. Thanks for watching. See you next time.